the Estadio Monumental de Maturí in Venezuela was the stage for a Comebol Classic. Argentina, the reigning world champions, clashed with the determined Venezuela side. However, it was Mother Nature who stole the show. Torrential rain transformed the pitch into a slippery, treacherous bog. Both teams struggled to maintain their footing. The conditions made for a scrappy, unpredictable match. Despite the adverse weather, the atmosphere in the stadium was electric. The Venezuelan fans, clad in their vibrant yellow jerseys, created a cauldron of noise. They hoped to see their team pull off an upset. The Argentinian supporters, though outnumbered, were just as vocal. They cheered on Lionel Messi and his teammates. Argentina started the match brightly despite the challenging conditions. Their early pressure paid off in the 28th minute. A well-worked corner kick found Nicolas Otamendi unmarked in the penalty area. The veteran defender made no mistake, powerfully heading the ball past the helpless Venezuelan goalkeeper. Otamendi's goal sent the Argentinian fans into raptures. It seemed like the perfect start for Lionel Scaloni's men. The early goals suggested that Argentina might overcome the weather and cruise to victory. However, Venezuela had other plans. They were determined to make life difficult for the reigning champions. As the rain intensified, the pitch continued to deteriorate. The slick surface made it increasingly difficult for Argentina to play their usual passing game. The ball skidded unpredictably. Players struggled to maintain their balance. Venezuela, more accustomed to the conditions, grew in confidence. They began to threaten the Argentinian goal. The Argentinian midfield, usually so dominant, struggled to control the tempo of the match. Their intricate passing moves broke down. Venezuela's physicality and direct approach began to cause problems. The underdogs sensed an opportunity to snatch a famous result. In the 71st minute, Venezuela found the equaliser their spirited performance deserved. Salomon Rondon, the experienced striker, capitalised on a moment of confusion in the Argentinian defence. He reacted quickest to a loose ball in the penalty area. Rondon slotted the ball past Emiliano Martinez to level the score. The Venezuelan fans erupted in celebration. Their team had defied the odds and held the mighty Argentina to a draw. The goal injected renewed energy into the match. Both teams pushed for a winner in the closing stages. However, the rain-soaked pitch continued to hinder any flowing football. Section 5, Martinez to the rescue. A standout performance in difficult conditions. Despite the draw, one Argentinian player who emerged with credit was goalkeeper Emiliano Martinez. The Aston Villa shot stopper made several crucial saves to keep Argentina in the game. His handling was impeccable in the treacherous conditions. Martinez's performance was a reminder of his importance to this Argentinian team. Martinez's saves proved vital in securing a point for Argentina. His performance highlighted the importance of having a reliable goalkeeper, especially in challenging conditions. While the Argentinian outfield players struggled to adapt to the pitch, Martinez stood tall. He ensured that his team left Venezuela with something to show for their efforts. Section 6 Reflections from the Storm Messi and Scaloni's post-match thoughts. After the match, Lionel Messi acknowledged the impact the weather had on the game. It was a very difficult match, Messi admitted. The pitch was in a terrible condition and it was almost impossible to play our natural game. Coach Lionel Scaloni echoed Messi's sentiments. We knew it was going to be a tough match, especially with the rain, Scaloni said. The conditions were the same for both teams, but it obviously didn't suit our style of play. I love Section 7, Road to 2026, Argentina's standing and the Bolivian challenge. The draw leaves Argentina in second place in the Conmebol World Cup qualifying table. They are five points behind leaders Brazil. While the draw was a setback, Argentina remains firmly on course to qualify for the 2026 World Cup. Argentina will be looking to return to winning ways in their next match. They face Bolivia at home on Tuesday. Bolivia will provide another stern test. Laverde will be hoping to capitalize on any lingering frustration from the Argentina camp. Section 8. Join the conversation. What are your thoughts on the draw? So, what did you make of Argentina's performance in the rain-soaked draw with Venezuela? 
Do you think the weather was the main factor in the result? Or were there other underlying issues in Argentina's performance? Share your thoughts and opinions in the comments section below.